so we're already feeling more relaxed and already open to the divine flow that is moving through us now. So let's just spend a few moments focusing upon our breath which leads us inwards as we receive from our tourists the beautiful blue light as we tune into and open to receive this blue light we begin to feel the qualities of this energy as we breathe we feel their presence their energy with us and we breathe it in relaxing down into the body and simply allowing it to flow The violet light which we have worked with so much is always in the blue Arcturian light. As we also receive into our energy fields the violet flame. The flame of transmutation as we simply rest in non-doing, the violet flame is transmuting within us all that needs to be released. But there is nothing for us to do here, simply to be, to be, to be in one's presence, one's I am as we allow ourselves to be to come into this now moment bringing into this very moment all of oneself this is quite empowering for more aspects of self have entered more aspects also of our higher self have come into this now moment which we are now experiencing together this now outside of time no past no future only this now which becomes our eternal focus I am my presence fully in the now. As you feel the empowerment of this through your solar plexus chakra, be assured that the violet flame is working around us and through us, together with the blue light coming from our Jewess. As we relax into this, we feel how comforting the Arcturian blue light is, how loving it is. And how safe we feel in a circle with no judgment. There is no judgment here. And as we sink into this from our hearts, it opens us to greater love within. For it is often the fear of judgment that keeps our hearts so closed. But the energy is flowing through at this time. Our 
empowering our hearts as our heart opens more and more easily into a realm of love, of light, free from judgment. And as we move into this space, we find we are free from fear. Let's spend a few moments within this beautiful energy as the Arcturians are cleansing our aura for us from any lower vibrational energies that we may have picked up. Or very few have a clear aura. And it is always a good exercise during your morning meditations to connect to the Arcturians and ask for a cleansing of our aura. We feel that taking place now. And as you become lighter, you feel the shimmering energy moving up through your aura, raising the frequency as gradually you become clearer, more balanced and in a higher alignment. We simply allow this to take place for us, for we have let go of doing in the ego self and are surrendered to the divine, to one's own higher self, the light of one's own soul. As our frequency rises, into the frequency of our soul, connecting us to our higher self, connecting us to the Arcturians who have lowered their frequency for us as we gently rise to meet as our frequency comes into resonance with the Arcturian frequency. Your consciousness rises and expands opening upwards and outwards and you feel the increase in your spiritual light that is moving through you. You begin to become more self-empowered from within your solar plexus, moving up through your heart and you may feel a pressure within your head, within your higher chakras and your pineal. Whatever you may be experiencing, simply let it be. We trust, the heart trusts absolutely in the divine for it knows it is moving closer to God, to Source. As the Arcturians continue 
they work upon us. As the violet flame is with us, we begin to feel the energy of Lord Merlin, a wonderful aspect of Saint Germain, bringing to this earth unto us its energy of transmutation, of magic and of joy. Allow the joy to rise within your hearts for in your presence of this eternal now. You are above, separated from your lower density of the lower self where all your anxiety lies. It is easy to come into joy as you absorb into your own being the magic, the playfulness, the light-heartedness of Merlin as he weaves this energy around us as Merlin's light activates within our own hearts we rise into joy to lightness of being And we feel more complete, more whole within. We simply breathe. We allow the flow without blockages, without interference, allowing it to go where it wishes to do what it needs to do, for we in our human selves are not in charge of this. It is decided on a higher plane, for it is what we are willing to let go of that can be transmuted, that can be dissolved and leave our being. As we feel this lightness, let us take a few moments in this energy. It is a higher light, a higher frequency, as we allow ourselves to lighten up. There is no heaviness here. There is no seriousness, no weight of being burdened. When we let go of all this and our headspace fills so much with light. Simply absorb this energy, become one with it, and be in gratitude, in love. As you send to men in your love, so you receive more from men in. as the light increases as you continue to expand and as the joy within your hearts blossoms. And the Algerians together with Merlin 
There is no separation for them with learning. They continue to raise our frequency. They raise our frequency. For they wish to take us to their starship Athena. They have sent down a corridor of light of blue light if they if we may move upwards through this corridor safely travelling through the astral plane without receiving any lower energies from this plane as we are completely we protected in the blue corridor. We may feel within as if we are gently spinning and as we spin gently around. It is maybe as if perhaps even the room may be spinning to allow this spinning sensation as you begin to rise out of your body upwards into the corridor. And through your third eye, you project my thought, yourself, into the starship Athena, where we all arrive together. Enioa and many Arcturians are here to greet us as well as many beings from other star systems who often spend time on this Athena ship. You may wish to greet some of them. Some of them may be familiar to you. We are receiving so much love from all that are here. We are even being greeted by them in honour of the work we do for our planet. Here once again you can experience your own powerful self within your solar plexus and your I am presence for you are here not with just the human self but you are here in this starship with more presence of more of who you are even your Arcturian presence has come to join you as you feel the connection through your crown of your Arcturian self. And so you greet these beings of light as an equal standing in your own light accepting your own power as the great being of light you are equal to those light beings with you as you stand in your own light and allow the feeling of oneness to come to you as you merge, as they merge. 
merging their energies with your energies, merging into that oneness, as you allow yourselves to feel equal to them. The Arcturian technology, of course, while we are here, continues to work with us. Activations, downloads, codes and healing all being received in abundance simply by being here in this realm, in this dimension. They have brought us here to begin to receive the coming solar eclipse energies. They wish for us now, through our hearts and our third eyes, to look out through the starship. It's as if there's an enormous window there. We look through the galaxy, the stars, the planets, the multitude of energies that are there. And we bring our focus for a moment on the moon Then we focus upon our sun. Our consciousness connects with the consciousness of our sun. And we begin to feel, to experience the energies flowing towards us from the beauty and magnificence of the sun's consciousness, the heart of our sun. And we begin to receive its golden rays, filled with Christ consciousness. Jesus Ananda, Yeshua, of course, is with us. He is within the sun, within the consciousness of the sun, and we begin to receive the consciousness, the Christed light of Jesus Ananda, of Yeshua. And the energies from the sun is huge, magnificent and brilliant. The sun brings activations and downloads to us, sending us its codes of enlightenment. We simply receive this download without needing to know what it may be that we are receiving. We simply allow it to come to us. It is a huge upliftment.
Let us scream now. Closer to oneself. The energies of Jesus. As you feel within your hearts. His energy. Of unconditional love. Of compassion. The Christ of light that he holds for us. Jesus, Lord Sananda, Jesus is the master of letting go. We ask him to please receive into ourselves his energy of letting go. Relax. There is nothing to be done in letting go. Simply to be, to allow. Be open to receive his energy of letting go. In this energy there is forgiveness which allows for letting go. And you can say to him Anything that I am unable to forgive, please forgive for me as I receive you into my heart. the violet flame immediately transmutes And I feel the Christed light within my own heart. The beauty of letting go. We turn into such purity. It brings such peace within. The letting go, the transmutation continues as we continue to release, not by doing, but by intention. My intention to let go, to release, and to allow forgiveness to take place, 
with my heart filled with the light and love, the presence of Jesus, of Yeshua, the master of letting go within my own heart. Love does not judge. Judgment is a third dimensional state of being and in the fifth dimension we are in non-judgment. The heart, the fifth dimension forgives naturally. It does not need to learn how to forgive. It naturally feels and exudes love and compassion for its being is love and compassion. Its consciousness of who it is is a being of light, a being of divine love, which flows to us all the way from source, through the central sun, through the sun of our own sun, brought to us through Yeshua, as this higher state of being begins to be anchored within us and as it is so it becomes easier and easier to return to this state within throughout our days simply by intention and your solar plexus is becoming stronger your self-empowerment bringing to you the strength the courage that you need to come into the fifth dimension throughout your days. So we continue to absorb the Christ in light. Focus now upon your sun and the central sun behind your sun. the rays of light that you are receiving and the codes and activations that are in this light, the geometries, the codes, all flowing into you from the Athena and we are all together. And the many beings of light that are with us in this starship are all amplifying the light from the central sun for us. So 
So take a few moments now in the wonders of this realm as you absorb and integrate into the cells of your being all that is being offered here. So time now to move back into the blue corridor of light that will return you into your physical body as you move down through the corridor slowly and find yourselves in perfect alignment above your head as very slowly you re-enter into the physical body, moving down slowly, coming into your foundation, moving through your legs and connecting through your feet to the earth. Feel how much lighter you are, how you are less burdened, how there is joy within you and you feel the magic of Merlin and you open your eyes being present within the third dimensional realm as you look out with joy, with a new life within you. A new moment in the new earth.